I'm Kim. And I'm Penn. There's a hurricane literally coming to our house and we're trying not to freak out. So here are our hurricane holder hacks. We married with that name? Oh, uh, I mean, it's, it's workshopping it. If you're out of AA batteries, you can't find any in the stores, and you have some AAA batteries on hand, load them in like normal, fill the space with aluminum foil, and boom, let there be light. Speaking of light, if you have one of those headlamps and you have a bottle of water, look at what you can do with it. Turn it inside out and put it up against one of those kind of gallon jugs of water, and then check out what it looks like in the bathroom because no one wants to poop in the dark. Speaking of that, when you gotta go, you gotta go, and our dog will not go outside to go to the bathroom she if like it's the rain. storming and raining. So right now, landscaping companies will give you dead sod that they have extra, load it up in your garage so your puppy can pee and poo in peace. Fill plastic bags three quarters full and load them up in your freezer. It'll keep your freezer colder longer if you lose power, and it will give you fresh water as it melts. This one you did when you were growing up, which I've never heard of. If you're running out of cooler space, you can fill your washing machine with ice and keep the essentials cool. Washing machines are built to drain water, so no worries about a mess when it melts. If you lose power and you're without power for a while, you can get one of these solar power USB chargers. Once the hurricane passes over, it's almost always bright sunlight, and there are loads of these at electronic stores and on Amazon. This one's crucial to us, coffee. Get instant coffee sticks. If you lose power, your coffee source is gonna suffer, but with a gas stove, you can boil water and you can still have your morning goodness. The last one's probably most important. Go talk to your neighbors now. Find out what they need and if there's anything you can do to help them. And they may have something for you. For example, we have a generator. The guy across the street from us has a chainsaw. Hey, it works out. We as might need both. We've grown up through double digit hurricanes. As news reporters, we actually went into the hurricanes, which is, Insane. Stupid. Last thing we can say is be safe. If you watch people on the news standing on the beach, do not emulate them. Yeah, just stay safe, stay yeah. inside, enjoy your family, and we're praying for everybody's safety. Your news anchor comes out and you do a lot of arms. When your news anchor in it, it's a lot of this. I talk with my hands. You talk and it's like very like, hmm. You're very critical of me right now. No, I'm just like, this is like, you're just gonna get really excited. Just like,